doesn't matter if you get a deal or not. I mean, it's always helpful, but those companies who are going to go up and be successful know that the Sharks are just a stepping stone uh, on their path to success, and they don't depend on us, um, and they go out and prove us wrong, and a lot of, have, a lot of companies have done that, and I, and I love that. It's not a bad booby price. The people who don't make a deal on the show, you mean, with any of the Sharks, and go home empty-handed, go home with something that's a treasure. Publicity, watched by all those millions of people. They go home, and everybody recognizes them in their hometown, and suddenly they have creativity. So whether you win on the show or you lose on the show, you go home a winner. You know, I always try to be encouraging. If the entrepreneurs are honest and they really have their lives tied up in this, I really always try to be encouraging. You try to remind them that just the visibility of the show, just being on the show is going to give them a, a leg up versus any entrepreneur. Not all companies can get an investment, but those same companies can still be successful. It's good to get a deal. Shark Tank is an incredible format, but just because you get a no in the tank, doesn't mean you're not going to make it. It's just like in life. We're just another path to success. When they do succeed, does that, does that sort of speak to the power of Shark Tank? No, I think that no matter what, it's always going to speak to the power of the entrepreneur. Way before Shark Tank existed, there's been entrepreneurs, and I think way after Shark Tank, uh, there's going to be entrepreneurs. It's always about the person. It, it speaks to the power of the audience willing to give a shot to the entrepreneur.